All right, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to downgrade your Compiz from Natty to Maverick. So pretty much, um, this person has made a PPA that allows you to downgrade your Compiz from you know Natty to the previous version, which is which was in a uh, Maverick. So I actually tried this um, about a week ago on my laptop, and it didn't work for me. But this morning, web update had a little article about it, so I decided to give it a go again, and um, you know, and it worked. And um, I had a little quirks here and there that um, the tutorial didn't work exactly, but I managed to, you know, get around it. So, um, anyways, basically what this is for is for people who don't want to use Unity and who are experiencing a lot of plugin, I mean, sorry, a lot of um, crashing, I guess, with Compiz, like the plugins and stuff. I made a couple of videos before on how to get around some of that things, you know, with the whole cube and whatever. And uh, this seems to be a pretty solid answer for that so hopefully uh, this will work out on this computer so on this computer of mine is basically a little test machine so I'd rather you know try it out in here and if my computer crashes and, and you know whatever at least it's my computer not yours so so I'm just gonna give it a go and see what happens and uh, hope for the best I guess <laughs> but pretty much in a nutshell what's gonna happen you're not gonna be able to use Unity anymore and some of the plugins that you that that came with it like the uh, like the snapping feature, those are gonna go away. All right. So, anyways, let's get started. What it's asking you to do here is a sudo app get purge compiz. So basically, it's gonna be removing compiz and all of its components from your system. So, copy, go to terminal, and uh, paste this in, into it. Hit enter. Type your password. All right. Hit yes, Y for yes. All right, it's gonna be removing all that stuff. Okay, the second one, sudo app get purge compass setting manager. Hit enter. Yes. You see them to purge. Okay. All right, that's done. All right, so now I want you to add uh, the PPA. Oh, not yet. I'm sorry. This is if you're using Emerald. Emerald is another uh, window decorator or window man. Well, not manager. I guess decoration or what do you want to call it? Like this on top. What I'm using now is uh, Metacity or Metacity. Um, Emerald is like another way of doing it. If you use Emerald, you know what it is already. It's like it's like a, a transparent window manager thing. I don't know. I used it before in the past. But if you have that, run this line. If you don't, skip it, which I don't. All right, now come down here, and this is going to be adding the repository. Paste. Hit enter. It's going to take a couple seconds. I'm using this USB Wi-Fi on this uh, little... Uh, computer of mine. That's another issue I kind of have with it. It seems that the network manager manager is not really handling USB Wi-Fi dongles, I guess. Um, it worked fine on Pardis Linux, if you ever heard of that one. But this on Natty, for some reason, it's kind of quirky. Copy. Pseudo app get update. All right. All right, let me go grab the other line. Pseudo app get upgrade. Copy. That's basically if there's any, uh, any uh, what do you call it, uh, updates, it'll install it. Hit yes. Compiz back in. So okay, it's going to upgrade all the uh, Compiz components. And this is going to install the rest of it. Compiz core, Fusion plugins, Fusion plugins extra, unsupported back in all kinds of stuff in there so it's gonna grab all that stuff for you too paste 
Hit enter. Yes. All right, almost done. Okay, it's done. So what I'm going to do is uh, go ahead and log out, log back in, and I'm just going to take it from there. All right, so I just logged back in, and uh, let me open up a window here. All right, so you can see Compass is working. I don't know if you can tell, but there's little shadows and stuff, so it's working. And uh, there's no more of the uh, you know grid feature. You can actually have that feature, you know what I mean? Um, there's some plugins in there you can mess with and get it working again, but I mean the nice one that 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 was made for Natty, I guess uh, that's not there anymore. So, anyways, so um, oh you do have your little scroll bar thingies, I guess the overlays. So that that stayed. So that's I guess that's cool. But anyways, uh, let me go to my Compiz setting manager. All right. So I guess this is the moment of truth where basically uh. For everybody else who uh, who tried this with Natty, uh, let me get my where's it at system monitor so you can see that I'm yeah I am using Natty. There it is Natty. So uh, let me enable the cube and hopefully it doesn't crash my system. Rotate. Let's see uh, viewpoint switchers enabled. Try that again. Uh, how about uh? animations, 3D windows, wobbly windows, disable snapping, uh, all kinds of stuff. So let's see if it worked. There's your wobbly windows. There's your cube. So looks like it's all good. It's working. So um, anyways, the issue, that, the issue that I had with my laptop, some of the packages didn't want to remove, right? I guess I was getting some type of dependency issue or something and what I had to do on that I really don't recommend doing it but if you want to do it you know uh, type this Let's see what's it at I can find it in here there it is sudo add good auto remove comp is I believe it's star dot star and that'll kind of get rid of like a lot of the junk so uh, well that's what worked for me basically is what I'm saying so do that if you want then go ahead and, and um, you know like like this first portion right here like instead of doing this um, do that and that's how I resolved the issue with my laptop it, it this didn't want to work for me so I had to do that instead and it worked so uh, then just follow the procedure like like I said before and hopefully it worked for you guys because it worked for me so Anyways, thanks for watching.